Yeah, just while the tide's a little bit lower. I might just throw this in there. Just get a feel for what's happening. If there's anything fighting. Just hook, hook the fish. Actually a decent size. Oh, flooded. First fish of the day. Oh, he's off. He's just here. Nice big flatty. All right, here's another little flatty. Oh, just a little one right on the edge here. There he is. Let's let him go. Nice and quickly. So yes. Yeah, there we go. He's away. <laughs> he was sitting right here on the edge. Okay, let that drop down. Decent size, buddy. Just down here in the water. Just wrapped himself up a little bit. Still a bit green, but I'll bring him in anyway. So yeah, that's uh, another flatty. Really nice colours, I'll let him go before he spikes me. There he goes. Phew. Okie dokie, so I just want to show you just what I'm using. So this is just an old 4 inch wriggler and I've just got some of this Berkeley Gulp rub on scent. So I'm just putting some of that on there. Maybe every dozen dozen casts or so. Or you could do it after every fish. This stuff really helps. Um, so yep, you just want a fair bit of that on there. That'll entice the fish to bite a bit more. Um, yeah, so that's... This is the scent I'm using. I also use S-Factor scent. But I just find this... Whichever scent you use, it really in, increases the uh, strike rate. So yep, I'll get back out there and cast this one. stop the camera there but yeah just another little guy Oop, and he's off all right so that was easy release out here attacking bait it's a massive school of bait here and I'm gonna try and work out what they are and hook one they're just sitting out out there I think it might be broom I'm just going to slow roll this through it.
drags a bit too loose. Decent size little flatty. Just got to get him up. Try and release him. Just on the double clutch. Just get some pliers and. Whereabouts? Oh, you're on. Oh. <laughs> what is that? Is it fatty? Oh, it's a long tom. That's all right. <laughs> what is this thing? Fatty. Thank you. 